Hello everyone, my name is Cam, and welcome to another Ramshar Minecraft plugin tutorial. Before we get started, be sure to drop a like and subscribe for more tutorials. Plugins are a useful tool for your Minecraft server. They allow you to add many different cool features and customizations such as ranks, game modes, and rules. Today, we will be going over a plugin called Post Commands. This plugin allows you to trigger commands just by walking over a block. So starting out, make sure to install the plugin first. If you don't know how, look to the top right for the icon on how to install plugins. After installing the plugin, restart and head into the config files. To get there, go to your server, click on the files drop down tab and click config files. You are looking for the file called pulsecommandsconfig.yml. Here is everything you can configure for the plugin. At the top is the first configuration for the trigger block. So as you can see, the top trigger block is an oak pressure plate and the bottom trigger block is bedrock. So when you place both of these down, it will trigger a command that you can set below. This plugin also allows you to set up a teleport after trigger feature that will then teleport the player to a set coordinate after the This helps prevent command spamming issues. So here, you could set where the player would teleport after they stepped on the pressure plate and just type in the X, Y, N, Z coordinate that you want to use. And then under that is where you can set up to four commands for the first triggered block. But do note that to use all four of these command slots, you have to change false to true for the command enabled. Then at the bottom, you can set what command you want the block to trigger. You do not need to add the backslash for the command. So here I will set a command to give myself a diamond ore. Then if you scroll down you can see that you can set another trigger block. So for this one it's a stone pressure plate for the top block and a redstone block for the bottom block. Then I will enable it by setting this to true and I'll set it so I will get an emerald block every time that I step on it. So after configuring, click save and restart your server. Now head into your server and when you place down the two trigger blocks, it should trigger the command that you configured in the config. And that's it for this plugin. If you have any more questions or want to check out more features that this plugin has, I will leave the plugin page in the description. That is how you can incorporate the POS commands plugin on your Minecraft server. Thanks for watching.